Welcome back, and thanks for joining Ty the Gun Guy! Today we're going to go over some accessories on the Springfield Armory St. Victor pistol, 7.5 inch barrel. Uh, right now it's one of my most viewed videos. I've got over 20,000 views and there's probably a reason for that. It's definitely becoming more popular and I want to show you guys what I did. It's pretty much just focus on the accessories, so let's go take a look. I want to talk about some accessories on the Springfield Armory St. Victor pistol, seven and a half inch barrel. Magazine is unloaded, the gun is clear for safety. First thing I want to start with, of course, is my Olite. This is the PL Pro Valkyrie by Olite right here. It's an absolute wonderful light, very bright, rechargeable. And with this, you guys can use my coupon code TOD10, T O D D 10. That's TOD10. You guys get 10% discount. All right, you got your MOE. This is for the uh, Olite. It's a Picatinny rail section. They call it five slot or five, one, two, three, four, five. That's how large it is there. And that fits the uh, Valkyrie Pro absolutely perfect. This is M-Lock. A lot of people were asking me, this is direct to get the M-Lock attachment. This is your M-Lock four rail so that it fits right to it. You got the angle four grip on the front here. Again, this is direct into the four grip. So this will be the M-Lock as well, coming from Magpul. Just make sure you guys get M-Lock accessories for everything that you put on the front rail here. <clears throat> Since I'm using this, uh, believe it or not, actually on my nightstand every night, goes to bed with me. Uh, I do have the SIG Romeo 5. Make sure it's motion activated. As soon as you move it a little bit, the red dot's going to come on. After it sits for so long, it'll turn off so it doesn't kill your battery life. So I think this is very, very important, especially for self-defense, home protection. You're not going to sit there if somebody comes in and, and turn the on button on the red dot. So get the motion activated on the Sig Sauer Romeo 5 red dot. As well as the iron sights. And what I did is I actually took this off this is Midwest Industries I believe is the rear sight the front sight was from my M&P 22 uh, that was Smith & Wesson that's all I had right now eventually I'm gonna probably get a different one for the front but it works why did I do that well if I'm using this for home protection and my red dot battery goes dead it's not working I have the iron sights as backup to get me on target mm. alright I changed the grip on this thing I went with the ATI I believe they're out of Wisconsin and this is a soft rubbery grip in the back with a hard polymer in the front it's got the finger grooves right here for me that's very very comfortable some guys don't like the, the softness or the mushiness feel of this but for me it's got uh, lines vertical or horizontal lines here and your hand won't slip so I absolutely love that grip I think it's for me it's a must do all right I've got my uh, single point sling right here it's by CAA, which I think is Command Arm. And uh, the nice thing about this is that it is a quick disconnect. So you've got the quick disconnect right here. Okay. Didn't come with it. So you actually have to get that separate. Here's where I got them from. A pack of two actually on Amazon. It was pretty cool, pretty inexpensive. And they're heavy duty. Um, U.S. made. So this is very nice. It matches in flat dark earth. And it comes with two. So, heavy duty, robust QD, quick disconnect for your single point sling that I use. All right, I was lucky enough for my buddy to get a Magpul. I think this is the uh, Gen M3. So it is flat dark earth. I think it matches very well like that. It's been wonderful, it worked like a dream so far. So get yourself the Magpul. All right, there's been a lot of controversy about the uh, St. Victor pistol because it's only seven and a half inches. Um, I've had it 50 yards, no problem. Groups of three inches. So uh, I think it'll do the job and do what I have to do. It may be loud, but I'll take my chances with that. So I'll go ahead and accessorize it. Get it for your home protection. Get one of these guys in your hands. Get it to the range. Get with somebody that may have one. And until next time, tie the gun guy!